I used to date a guy named Joe who was really into ghost hunting in abandoned properties. There was a large plantation house near where we lived that was the scene of a multi-murder. We used to go there a lot, sometimes just the two of us, sometimes with others in tow. One night while hanging out with some friends, on a total spur-of-the-moment decision, we decided to head over to the house. There were eight of us total, so we had enough people to cover all areas of the house and the barn at the same time. We'd never had that many before, because when you do things like that, breaking into abandoned buildings, it's best not to have a bunch of cars parked around in the driveway. But one friend had their van, so we all piled in and set off to find us some ghosts. We decided to pair off in twos and put each team in a section of the property. Two in the barn, two in the basement, two on the main floor, two on the second floor, and two in the attic. We promised that we would each stay in our assigned places and observe for 20 minutes. So Joe and I ended up being assigned to the second floor. At this point, I had been to that house at least 15 times, and I'd walked through the entire thing. I knew it as well as I knew my own home. Except that night, there was something different. Now this is going to sound really stupid, but I swear on all my loved ones' lives, it's true. There was a large bathroom on the second floor that I'd never seen before. I kid you not, I've never seen that bathroom before in my life. It connected two of the main bedrooms, bedrooms that I'd been in a hundred times before. The bathroom had this big giant clawfoot tub. It's not something that you could miss, you know? It freaked me out, but Joe thought it was so cool that he made me spend the entire 20 minutes of our time in that bathroom. I was seriously worried that if it would fade out of existence, it would take me with it. Spoiler alert, it didn't. I'm still here in the earthly realm. But here's the kicker. I went back one last time to that house. Guess what? The bathroom was gone. I went through every inch of that house, not just the second floor, looking for it. I walked through every doorway, looked in every hole in the wall, and double-checked all the closets. And that bathroom was just gone, like it had never existed. I still don't know how to explain that.